it's about quarter past five in the morning here in Lima, Peru. I'm gonna run a little bit, maybe six kilometers until somewhere in that point. And let's see, it's very early in the morning and I want you to come with me <laughs> in this little adventure. Please join me. That's the the market which is close to the beach where all the fishmen come and leave their production, I don't know, their fishery, their fish and people can go there and get them. It is supposed to be a little bit more or it is supposed to be cheaper than getting fish in the local market. So let's continue our run. This is the Regatas Club in Chorrillos, which is an exclusive club in Peru, focus on, you know, nautic sports. The sky is still dark, so I have to keep running this way. Okay, we are going this way. It's a kind of alley. And you know, this part of the running reminds me, I don't know, Cusco, maybe. Okay. We are almost by the sea level. Just because the beach is over there. We are getting closer and closer. It's getting better over there. The sky is getting clear. Okay. Can you see the sound of the sea? Okay, let's continue our run. Okay, we are <laughs> near the Cala restaurant, which is an exclusive restaurant here in Lima. And people are like getting ready to surf. Okay, we have to get to that point and you will see it's a very very beautiful view from that point Okay, we are getting closer. The stones are wet. In general, this path is wet due to the waves of the sea. Okay, 
We are uh, in the middle of my running journey, in the middle of my, you know, my way. It's been about six kilometers until this point, up to this point. And you know, it's about six in the morning, more or less, perhaps 5.50 or something like that. But it's a pretty nice view, very energetic place. The sun is still, the sky is still cloudy, but still, you know, the sky is getting like clearer. Woo! And you can see the waves. Look at that. Okay, it's time to go back home. It's about six and uh, quarter past six, maybe. And as you can see, the sky is now brighter than before, clearer than before. The sun is about to shine again in Lima. So I'm gonna take some pictures and make some videos in my way. So I hope you enjoy. Okay. <laughs> now, people are about to surf around there. You know, there is a bunch of guys getting into the sea. Ah, okay, this is a sort of surf academy over here. Aloha, that's another surf academy. Alejandro, a friend of mine, suggested that we should join to one of those surf academy. You know, in order to enjoy the sea and maybe get a good shape. But I think that in order to get that, it will demand, you know, a sort of... Uh, you have to, to surf almost every day, you know, as, as much as possible in order to, to, to be, uh, you know, a surfer, properly talking, you know, it's not something like Okay, well, let's... I don't know, it's my way of thinking. Okay, I'm gonna sit over there. This is a sort of viewer since where you can see all the beach. Okay, as mentioned before, 
it's about five kilometers left I mean there are more or less between four and five kilometers from here to my home so maybe in about uh, half an hour I will be able to get home but it would be a good idea if we watch the place you know enjoy the environment the sound of the seagulls and the waves and you know the ocean around it's a pretty nice experience and it's like a hidden gem in Lima because not many people come you know to run early in the morning maybe people come to the beach you know as usual I mean during the daylight when the sun is shining during the summer season and things like that but in the morning it's a different experience it's totally different very energetic a lot of stamina you know but I think it's time to get home so let's let's do it okay I'm ready on in the PR of Chorrillos and that's a panoramic view of the beach Do you remember the first time when we saw the beach and it was very dark and it is it was just because it was very early in the morning uh, 6 a.m. 6 and a quarter a.m. and it's about 7 7 30 maybe here in Lima right now and the sky is is already clear the daylight I mean the sun is about to shine right now still it's a little bit cloudy but it's pretty nice okay let's continue our run about four kilometers left and uh, 11 kilometers already run a little bit tired but it's okay let's go <laughs> 